Hello friends, hope you're doing great. In today's lesson, let's do some conversations on different topics. The first one is between two friends about a birthday event. So let's get started. Friend one, hey, guess what? It's your birthday next week. Friend two, oh, really? I totally forgot about that. What plan do you have in mind? Friend one, I'm thinking of throwing you a surprise birthday party. How does that sound? Friend two, a surprise party? I'm excited. I know you always tend to come up with some unique ideas. Friend one, I'm glad that you are excited. This time, let's make it unforgettable. Do you have any specific idea for the party? Friend two, well, I love outdoor gatherings with an ambience of good music and food. And of course, having all our friends there would be fantastic. Friend one, perfect. I'll arrange everything, get ready for a birthday bash. You won't forget. Friend two, thanks a lot. I can't simply resist further to wait. It's going to be epic. Friend one, hey, I was thinking it would be awesome to go hiking this weekend. What do you think? Friend two, hiking sounds great. I was really thinking to spend some time close to nature. By the way, where were you planning of going? Friend one, I found one of the beautiful trails in the mountains, not too far from here. It has amazing views as well as a waterfall at the end. Friend two, that sounds fantastic. Count me in. Should we pack some snacks? to create an atmosphere of a picnic when we read the waterfall? Friend one, certainly. I'll bring some sandwiches and fruits. It's going to be so refreshing to have a picnic by the waterfall after a good hike. Friend two, I can't wait nature, good company, and a picnic. Sounds like the perfect day. I'm awfully inspired for suggesting this idea. Thanks a lot. It's going to be awesome. See you. Bye. The next conversation is between a lawyer and a client. Lawyer, good morning, Mr. Smith. Thanks for coming in today. How can I assist you with your case? Client, good morning. I appreciate you taking the time to see me. Frankly speaking, I need your help with the legal matter I have been dealing with recently. Lawyer, of course, I'm here to help. Could you provide me with some details about your case so I can better evaluate the situation? Client, certainly. I have been having some issues with my landlord regarding the lease agreement and I believe that they are not fulfilling their obligations. Lawyer, I see. Let's go through the particular details of your lease agreement and the concerns you have. It's however essential to ensure your legitimate rights are protected under the terms of the contract. Client, that would be great. I feel like I'm not being treated fairly and I want to know what options I have to address this situation according to law. Lawyer, good enough. Well, review the lease agreement thoroughly and discuss the potential courses of action available 
in this regard. Our goal is to seek for a resolution that aligns with your best interests and rights as a tenant client. Thank you so much for your assistance. I feel relieved knowing that I have a real professional lawyer like you on my side to help resolve fully this legal challenge. Lawyer, you're welcome, Mr. Smith. Rest assured, I'll work diligently to advocate for your rights and work towards a favorable outcome for your case. We'll proceed with a strategic approach to address the issues with your landlord effectively. Thanks. Now let's move into a conversation between a criminal and a police officer. Criminal. Hey, officer, what's going on? Why am I being stopped? Police officer, good day. We have received reports of a robbery in this area matching your very description. Can you tell me where were you about an hour ago? Criminal, I was just walking around, minding my own business. I didn't do anything illegal or wrong. Police officer, understandable. However, we need to verify your whereabouts. Can you explain why you're in possession of items that match the description of the stolen goods? Criminal. Oh, those. I found them lying around. I didn't steal anything, I swear. Police officer, I see. It's crucial to investigate this further. I'll need to take you down to the station for further questioning and to verify your alibi. Criminal. Come on, officer. You gotta believe me. I didn't do anything wrong. A cognizable offense. This is all a misunderstanding. Police officer. I hear you. But we have a duty to investigate any potential leads. Let's head to the station so we can clear things up. Cooperation will definitely help resolve this situation swiftly and fairly. Okay, 